Oh, okay. I think it's working. Anyway, hey guys, what the? Welcome back to another video. And sorry, I haven't been uploading lately. Um, but anyway, as you can see today, I'm on a new horse. I got a lot of new horses, and I'll show you at the end what they look like. But this is one of them, and I know it's an old model, but I think it's actually pretty cute. Um. Anyway, we're gonna train today because I haven't done that in a while. And as you can see, Chocolate Brother is level three. Um, so we are gonna try to, you know, change that up a little bit. And at the end of the video, I'll show you the other horses I bought um, because I bought some other ones too. I think I got, let's see. Yeah, I bought three others. So I bought four horses in all. And now I'm saving my star coins because tomorrow Yorvik Wilds are coming out. Yorvik Wilds are going to come out. And I am going to make a video on the Yorvik Wilds. So fun. Also, sorry I didn't make a video on the, um, the Pharaoh quests. Um, yeah, sorry about that. <laughs> but anyway, um, there was really nothing to film about really. Because it was mostly kind of just boring quests. Um... And I don't really understand what you craft, but anyway, we're training, as I've already said so. Um, and hopefully I can get Chocolate Brother to at least level five today, because I haven't made a video in a while, so I kind of want to make this a bit of a longer one, and then tomorrow I'm going to film the, um, the New Yorvik Wilds. I, and by the news, or not the news clip really, but the um the spoiler to next week's uh, next week's update they said they were going to be kind of originals so i'm thinking they might be the smaller ones like the um the red the blue and the purple ones and if they are i'm probably not going to buy any um but if they're the bigger ones you know i might buy a few some people are also thinking also thinking it's going to be like the spring um lusitanos because they came out with them last year. They had the, well, I guess they're kind of summer Lusitanos, but they were Yorvik Wilds and Minka Stoneground, Stoneground is coming with them. And, or they're coming with Minka Stoneground. Minka Stoneground, and normally I'd say, well, I think they're gonna be newer one, like they're gonna be new Yorvik Wilds because um, they've never come with Minka before, but they said it, they were gonna be like classical, so, or like classic ones. So I don't think they're going to be new ones. Um, I'm really excited though, and I'm probably not going to end up buying any because I don't really like the Orvik Wilds much, honestly. Um, I don't know. I really like realistic horses, and I know you guys might be thinking, well, the old model Andalusian isn't realistic. I know it's not realistic, but I think it's cute. But like all my other horses, except for this one, are realistic. So, you know, um, fun. I don't know who just logged on, but I guess we could check. Uh, oh, someone logged, someone in the club logged off. I think it said, I thought it said logged on, but it said logged off. Um, okay, anyway, also I'm in a new club. Um, it's actually pretty new. Me and Melissa Pan, well, I don't think I co-own it, but I'm in it. And we made it not yesterday, but the day before. As you can see, we're growing really quickly. Um, and we had an event tonight at 7, but I don't think that's going to happen. So I'm just training anyway, or I'm just training because only one other person's on it. It's not even like, a um, not even the club owner, unless they logged off. Oh no, me and um, Sky are on. I know her username is like Liv, but we call her Sky. That's her nickname. Anyway, okay, these ponies are really cute and I really want one. So maybe if I don't end up buying any any of the Yorvik Wilds tomorrow, I might buy one of these. Mm, I don't know. You guys, you guys are gonna have to come back tomorrow to see if I buy one of those. And even if I don't buy, um, I <laughs> yeah, you guys are gonna have to come back tomorrow though to see if I buy one of them or to see if I buy a horse at all. Um. Anyway, we are gonna run to the ferry so we can catch the um. I almost said trailer. So we can catch the ferry to Fergrove. Sorry, my inventory is so full. Um, I'm wearing the club outfit right now, actually, except it's this saddle, but I can't put the saddle on the old model. So I'm just wearing this one instead. Um, and then I just have a bunch of random outfits in here. 
So yeah, this is, anyway, this is Chocolate Brother, aka Coffee. Um, I think it's really cute, actually, and like, I kind I like the gates a lot. Um, so yeah. Mm. Okay, sorry, my friend texted me. <laughs> and we were gonna, you know, call, but she's, um, she's doing something else. I was like, I'll just film a video while I'm waiting for her, and now she's doing something else with her brothers, so, you know. Okay, sorry. Um, anyway, just keep running to the Fort Penta trailer. Do, 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 do. <laughs> also, sorry I don't have my intro in the video anymore. Um, it got deleted from the computer somehow, but I will try making a new one as soon as I can. So, yeah, I'll try to make it sim similar and kind of, you know, better. Um, I don't know why I like the, uh, the gates of this old model so much, but I just do. I don't, I really don't know why. Oh, yay, here comes the fairy. I also want one of the old quarter horses, and for some reason I find the old ones cuter than the new ones. Like, I know the new ones are a lot more realistic, but, um, I find the, you know, I find the, the older ones cuter and the newer ones more realistic. So, yeah. If you guys could buy any old model, like, any old model, which old model would it be? Comment down below, like, any old model from Star Stable. And when I say old model, I mean, like, old model and illusions, old model ponies, old model... Shinko Teats, old model Arabians, really old model anything. Um, like the Icelandics don't count because they don't have an updated model. So anything that has a updated model. And yes, you can say fjords, even though they're not in the game anymore. Some people still have them. So which ones would you guys pick? Um, yes. I don't know why it sounds so weird, but like, mm, also, I'll try to get tomorrow's update video um, uploaded in the morning sometime, but I have a riding lesson at 1 o'clock, and then, but I have to leave at like 12, so I can, you know, brush and tack up and stuff. So fun. We are, you know, taking the ferry. I almost said trailer again. Why do I keep almost saying trailer? I don't know. Um, okay, I am so excited for the new, well, I don't know, I feel like I'm really excited for the Orbic Wilds, but at the same time, I feel like I'm not, because, you know, I don't, um, okay, I'm gonna just tell you guys all the horses I want really quickly, I have a long horse wish list, so I want an El Katik, um, I want a Lusitano, I want a Halflinger, I want an old starter body, I want a Morgan. Um, I want a Irish Cobb. I want uh, um, I want a North I want a North Swedish. I also want the Clydesdale in the app. I want the Andalusian and I want the Andalusian in the app. Um, is there anything I'm missing? Oh yeah, I also want an old quarter horse. Um, I want one. I want another new quarter horse. I want the um, Palomino one, I want the light chestnut one, I want the dark bay, and I want the red roan, so I can name them after horses at my barn. Um, one of the horses that I'm going to name after isn't there anymore, the Palomino, I wanted to name Dallas, Dallas isn't there anymore, um, I still want to get that one, and then I want to get the bay one and name it Dennis, and the red roan and name it Roni. And I want to get the chestnut one and name it Voodoo. Um, I know the chestnut one doesn't really look like Voodoo much, but um, it's the closest I'm ever going to get. Uh, I also think I want one of the, um, like, another one of the new Yorvik Warmbloods. I think I want the black one and I want to name it Jet. Oh, dang it. Okay. Um, honestly, I know some people have a lot of different opinions about these. But, like, I don't really want 
the thoroughbreds. Like, I don't want one of the new English thoroughbreds because honestly, I don't really like their gates that much. And their forelock, when you first get it, looks like it had a bob cut. So, um, I just don't really like them that much. And one of my friends got them and then said she regretted it so much. So I'm just gonna steer away from them until the new coat colors come out. And then like when the new coat colors come out, I'll rethink getting one. But honestly, at first I was like, I really want all three. Like I want the bay, I want the white one, and I want the black one. And now I'm like, no. Anyway, <laughs> sorry about that. Go, um, let's go back to the horses I wanted. I also want um, a dapple gray lip, a dapple gray lipizaner and a dapple gray, um, or I mean, and a black lipizaner. And I want to get the black lipizaner and name it Luna. Sorry, I have such a, like a long wish list. I just wanted to talk about that. Um, so yeah. Also, um. I'm going to talk about some updates I really want in Star Stable, and I know I've done this in many videos before, but I'm just going to do it again. So, um, also, if you guys could, you know, like, email Star Stable and tell them about any of these, um, you know, ideas, it might make them uh, think more about coming out with it, because I feel like the more people that tell them they want it, um, the more they'll considering let it out, letting it out. And the first one... I know it's something a lot of people want. Oh gosh, I okay. I was gonna say if I crash. Mm, okay, I know a lot of people want this, but I really want weather in the game. Um, weather would be really fun, especially for like realistic role plays, and you could like turn it on and off in your settings. Oh yeah, we're level four. Okay, like you could turn on rain, you could turn on snow, you could turn on thunder, and like you could turn on multiple at one time. You know what I mean? Um, I wish you could like open your settings and run at the same time, because if you open your settings, you just stop, which is really annoying. Um, okay, I also really want them to like um, make a generation three of the Morgans. I feel like the Morgans are really cute how they are, but I feel like, they just kind of need an update. So I feel like, um, I think the Morgans are generation two horses, because I know they've already been updated once. Um, so I keep saying like, um and like. Anyway, so the generation two horses are, okay, Morgans started with generation one and then they updated them to generation two and I feel like they're really cute how they are now but I think they should get updated again, just like, you know, a generation three horse or, yeah. Um, also, this is really a really random question, but do you guys think Star Stable is gonna come out with a generation four horse? I don't know, because, you know, the generation three horses are already really detailed and realistic. So I don't, I wouldn't, like if I was the Star Stable team, I wouldn't have any ideas for Generation 4 horses, to be completely honest. And I know a lot of people have a lot of ideas, but I just don't. Um, I really want Star Stable to add Tennessee Walkers. I mean, maybe that could be a Generation 4 horse. Um, but I feel like Star Stable should just add Tennessee Walkers because a lot of people have been asking for them. I also really want Star Stable to update Dino Valley, like, a lot because... You know, I kind of like Dino Valley, it's kind of cool, but it's just, I mean, it could use an update. I also think Star Stable should update, um, I also think, sorry, I keep pausing, I'm trying to find my words. I think Star Stable should probably update Steve's farm, because Steve's farm needs some serious help. Also, um, Silverglade Village, they need some help. You know, they're just not cutting it. Um, also, I feel like Manor should probably have an update. A lot of areas I want updated. And Golden Hills got updated, which was really good. Golden Hills needed it. Um, Moreland got updated. <laughs> Moreland needed it. And Fort Pinta got updated, which is really good because, you know, Fort Pinta also needed it. Sorry, I'm going over here. I'm going to get some flax for the... 
the fair requests. <laughs> uh, anyway, I think I'm going to go to Steve's. Speaking of Steve's, um, yeah, Steve's really needs an update. And I feel like not only Steve's, but like the whole area. Like when I say the whole area, I mean Will's Mill, Steve's, Silverglade Village, Marley's Farm, Hollow Woods, like that whole area there. And then maybe like, you know, a few months or not a few months, but about a month later, do Manor and Valedale. Yes, Valedale needs an update. And I know the Fergrove races got, um, got updated, but I feel like Fergrove Village should get updated. Basically the whole map that hasn't gotten updated yet needs an update. That's basically what I'm saying. But like, see over here, let's not, you know, end my horse. Over here, these trees, they're very nice and detailed. Um, I don't know why Star Stable updated this, but didn't update like Steve's farm or anything. So see, we have very detailed, pretty trees, very detailed grass and um, bushes. And then we come over to Hollow Woods here and the leaves look like straight up vomit. The grass isn't as detailed and like all the leaves just look like vomit. So um, yeah, Star Stable, please help us. Anyway, oh yeah, also the castle. That castle needs to be updated. Um, yes, let's just start up here because I'm already here. And I don't know why, I just really wanted to train. And I was like, you know what, let's just do it. And I really wanted to train Chocolate Brother. I started training Peppy, my Connemara, and then I was like, you know what, no, this is too much or not too much, but like I've been training Peppy so much lately. She's level 12 now. I was like, you know what? No. So I just got out Chocolate Brother and I was like, you know what? Let's make a video on this. And I had already done the opponent races. That's why I was at South Hook. And then I was like, oh, let's just make a video. Sorry, I also haven't been like following my video schedules. I said I would upload every other day and I'm gonna try to do that, no promises, but I'm gonna try. And all that matters is that I'm trying, honestly. Yas. Um, also, we have a show in three weeks. And it's like one show. No spectators allowed. Literally an adult and their rider. So I'm really excited for that. Because I'm going to be showing in three different classes. Like English. So I'm also taking a bunch of lessons. Um, so yes. That's also why I haven't been able to upload a lot lately. Um, also, I noticed we had 41 subscribers, so thank you guys a lot for that. Um, honestly, my dream and goal is to get 100 subscribers, and I know that's going to take time, but, you know, for those of you who are watching and aren't subscribed, what are you doing? Can you please subscribe? And, like, I'm not trying to beg you, but, you know, 100 is, like, my dream and goal, and... If you guys got me to 100, honestly, I'd probably do, like, a huge Star Stable giveaway, like, um, a huge Roblox giveaway, like, I'd probably do, like, a Star Coin giveaway, probably, um, like, I'd make a bunch of random Star Stable accounts and make some of them Lifetime Star Rider and give those away for you guys, and then, um, and then I'd probably also do like a bunch of Adopt Me pets, like really legendary pets. And um, yeah, also on my TikTok, we need like what, 20 more followers until we're at 400 followers on my TikTok. Like what, that's crazy. I never thought I'd get there, but you know, we are just gaining followers every day. Um, so if you guys aren't following my TikTok, then go follow my TikTok. It's at the Horse Life Zero, no capitals or spaces. Um, also, go follow Melissa Panda River. And yes. <laughs> okay, I'm going to try not to sing songs and get copyrighted because, you know, let's not do that. Mm, me casually getting copyrighted. Oh, nice. Um, also, I'm gonna try to continue my roleplay series soon, but, like, we moved servers. I'm on Windstar now, um, so if you guys, so, like, I don't have anybody to continue with unless I continued with M Melissa Panda River and I'll ask her about it. I don't know if she wants to, though. Um, 
And it would also be easier because we could FaceTime and do it. So yes. Um, let's see, we have 10 bunnies and one minute and three seconds left. So yeah, if you guys like would want me to do that with her, make sure you like this video because yeah. Also, um, I don't think my other video got to 10 likes because I said if it got to 10 likes, I would show you guys a free Yorvik Shillings glitch, and I don't think it got to 10 likes. So, um, I'm sorry, but I can't show you that glitch. I might do it on my TikTok. Like, I might show you guys on my TikTok. So, you know, that's just more of a reason why to go follow my TikTok, because you'll be able to know how to get free shillings. And, you know, you can buy food, outfits, tack, and it's like, it's not even a simulator where or anything, it's literally just a glitch in the game. And it's a pretty simple glitch and an easy glitch too. So after this video is done, I'm gonna go on my TikTok and film a video. So you guys should probably go to my TikTok or like after, you know, watch this video, after you watch this video and after you like it, you should go to my TikTok and, you know, check out the video. Okay, Steve is so laggy. Oh, wow, Steve is hiding from me. Steve, do you not like my horse? Do the old models offend you? Well, I'm sorry, but I am not changing my horse. I think it's cute. So, you can just stop. Like, there was a person with an old model um, Arabian over there, and the old model Arabians kind of look like spiders, but that's fine, you know, girl, you do you. Okay, Um, I feel like a lot of people on Windstar are clubless. I don't know. I feel like I just had to say that, like everybody, almost everybody at Steve's and, um, at Steve's and Starshine are loveless. Um, also I was looking through my videos and on my video where like Starshine Ranch got updated, I said Sunshine Ranch. I was like, oops. And now I look back at it and I'm like, mm, oops, it was Starshine. Anyway, um, we're just casually doing Steve's race, and I'm trying to do it as fast as I can, because Steve's is really laggy, and I just want to get out of here. So, let's just do Steve's race, and then we'll go to Marley's. Um, yeah, so, sorry my voice keeps cracking, it's late, and I'm kind of tired, but it's fine. We are probably going to also end the video soon, because I still got to, like, upload it, and, you know, I want to get that, I want to get it uploaded tonight. So, yeah, I probably will, um, and just so you guys know, it is 7.30 on Tuesday, so, um, you'll know if I got the video uploaded tonight, it should, like, when the video is uploaded, it probably should be around 9, I'm gonna say, it should probably be around 9 on Tuesday, June... Or is it June or July? I'm sorry. I don't know. Hang on. Hey, Siri. What? Okay. Sorry. I had to ask Siri. Um, hey, Siri. Go away. Okay. Sorry about that, guys. Um, I had to ask. So, if... If I uploaded this video on time, like I said, it should be around 9 o'clock Tuesday, June 30th, 2020. Well, obviously 2020, I'm not going to upload it next year. You know, I might, I just want to go to sleep for the rest of the year. Honestly, 2020 is a mess. Um, okay, I think um, coffee is actually going to be level 5 after these two races. So I'm probably going to finish the video after these, after Marley's, um, because coffee should be level five, and if not, then we're probably just gonna have to do the Baroness's racetrack, and he'll be level five. Because you know, since coffee's a lower level, um, he goes up quicker, and now it'll you know be easier. Well, it'll be easier until he gets to at least like level ten, and then he'll start going up levels slower. But it's good, you know. I've seen so many flat during this video so like don't come after me for not getting it but it's it's fine you know we're good I really don't care about the flax um also sorry if it's kind of loud it's raining I'm gonna be quiet for a minute and see if you guys can hear the rain 
Okay, I don't know if you heard that or not, but um, I think you did. So nice if you did. Um, I don't know if it was satisfying or not. Okay, look, there's another clubless person. Why is everybody clubless? Not actually ever. Oh, okay, Chocolate Brothers is already level five, but I know it's gonna bother you guys a lot if I don't do Marley's or, or if I don't do the barrel race and I just leave it to sit. So I'm gonna do that quickly and then we'll end the video because you know, coffee is level five. We went up, uh, wait, yeah, we went up two levels in this video. Yay, I'm really happy about that. Um, also, I'm not going to end the video just now because, remember, I promised you guys I would show you the horses I bought. So, yes. Let's just get my XP from Marley. Um, also, like, Marley, Carly, and Barney all need an update. Like, you know, that family just needs an update. Um, anyway... Yes, my home stable is New Hill because um, Melissa Panda River unlocked New Hill Crest. So we made our home stables here. Okay, so obviously the first new horse I got was Coffee. Um, sorry my camera is so zoomed out. I know it's going to bother you guys, so we're just going to bring it in. Excuse you. Oh, wow, that's close. Anyway, so I have Coffee level five i have this white frisian ember king aka ember who's level one i'm just gonna say their nicknames because like you guys can see so we have ember a white frisian level one okay we have cookie uh we have cookie my icelandic who's level four because i trained with cookie some the other day because she's just so cute and then i have and then my last one i got is AJ, my, the older thoroughbred, who is level, oh, I did not mean to get on AJ, um, who is level one. So, hopefully you guys like my decisions with the horses I bought. I hope you like the decisions. Um, anyway, this is Peppy, my Connemara I was talking about training. So, hopefully you guys like the decisions, and yeah, make sure you guys come back tomorrow to see if I buy any of the Orbic Wilds, or if I buy a different horse. Because, you know, you never know with me. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Again, thank you so much for 41 subscribers. Don't forget to go follow my TikTok, at the horse life zero, and go follow Melissa Panda River. I love you guys so much. Thanks for watching. Bye!